In the Emsland Convention Hall in Lingen, Germany, 250 black pied Holstein dairy cows are being auctioned off. Among those up for grabs will be Lily. Hein Eckenhorst has been working with this specific breed for over 30 years. It's like with models, cute and not too fat. Marco Stein is among the cattle traders waiting for Lily. He has 40,000 euros to spend on cows for Hungary. His competition is sitting at the tables around him, buyers from Spain, the Netherlands, Germany and Italy. Spain again, Italy again, I have 1,500 there. All that's needed to bid is a small gesture, a wink, a wave of the hand. The Italians stay in, the Spanish bow out. Marco makes his final bid. 1750, thank you to the right. For 1750, it's off to Hungary. The next day, the stall's in Emsland. Lily is a turbo cow. She produces more than 30 liters of milk each day. The Holstein is the Mercedes of dairy cows. The association's export manager, Henning Zerbe, has traveled extensively bringing cows to customers, whether in Saudi Arabia or Cuba. Holstein cattle are an export hit. It's a cow that produces a high quantity of milk in various locations. Even in the hot sun of North Africa, these animals can produce a large amount of milk. Lily's about to be loaded onto a truck. More than 28,000 cows leave here every year. By late afternoon, 30 head of cattle, including Lily, begin the 2,000-kilometer journey to Hungary. By midnight, they reach a small village near Würzburg for a mandatory rest stop. The European Union has imposed strict guidelines regarding the transport of livestock. After a few hours on the road, the animals have to get a break. The brief stopover costs 10 euros per animal. Lily is being milked. The stricter EU guidelines have increased the cost of transporting animals. The trip to Hungary is going to cost the customer 4,000 euros. As some struggle to pay that amount, the Breeders' Association arranges loans as required. The break lasts two hours. Next door, a consignment of piglets arrives from Denmark on their way to Italy. The next day, Lily and the rest of the cattle arrive in southern Hungary. The buyer is an immigrant from southwest Germany. The price of milk in Hungary is as low as in his home country, but cows that can produce high yields are in demand everywhere. Among Hungarian cows, the yield is about 20 liters per day. So there is a huge risk in buying here in Hungary. We could make large losses because the profitability wouldn't be there. The dairy farmer has big plans for Lily and cows like her. He wants to expand his dairy herd to a thousand head. His cows of choice are, of course, Holsteins. <laughs>